Hey everybody, Mandis Bunker here with Maximum Muscle Report. We're at the 2018 Tampa Pro. Biggest show yes. in the history of the IFBB. Yes, sir. Logan Franklin walks away your champion and he's going to the O. Yes, feels amazing, man. I mean, it's a grateful, I mean, it's an unreal feeling, like I said, um, on stage whenever uh, I was announcing, I mean, I've never done a Tim Gardner show. Uh, so, I mean, it was a great feeling being here. Everything was professional, ran really smooth. Uh, man, it was just a great experience. Now, I, I got a very interesting question for you, Logan. You know, because we were over there after pre-judging and we were having a conversation. And you were talking about next week, San Antonio, <laughs> as a classic guy. Is this something that you might still do for yourself? And still, you're going to the O as a men's physique athlete. But might you throw your hat in the ring and see what happens? You're already in shape. It was something that was already on your mind. Yes. Are um, you going to follow through or are you just going to go to the O? So, I am following through. Uh, a lot of people know that I am moving to classic. I uh, wanted to, you know potentially make one last run at the men's physique title. I mean, that's been a, a huge dream of mine, a huge goal of mine, and I truly believe that I am the best in this division. Uh, I just got a little bit of, a little bit of things I can tweak on, and, and then I can come in here, and and, and I, I, I believe that I can win this whole thing, but uh, I do plan on moving to classic physique um, after this after this Mr. Olympia, unless I, I I am able to, you know, successfully secure a, a Mr. Olympia title, I would definitely, you know, stay in Mr. Physique. All right, so then let me ask you this, because you, you did, I was following you until until I'm a the last. Brain dead, man. I'm no, no, like no, I was following you until the last sentence where you said you think you are the best in yes. in men's physique. In men's physique, yes, sir. Okay, yes, sir. So you're gonna go to the Olympia in men's and physique. compete in men's physique, but next weekend you are gonna you are no, no. gonna go compete in classic next weekend. No, sir. Um, I signed my classic debut contract. Um, I've already sent it in. Um, it's it's after the Olympia. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna announce what show it is. I want it to be a surprise. Um, you know, and, and I also don't want to, you know, announce it and have that pressure and that stress from, you know, you know, people right. talking and people like to say negative things. You know, I want to just have a clear head, and that's what I, I managed to do on this prep. You know, I, I managed to stay under the radar. You know, a lot of the, a lot of the top guys, you know, they never said my name in any kind of interview, and I like that. You know, I like that they're they're not paying attention to me, uh, but they know that I'm going to be right there next to them. So um, that's what I want to do with my classic debut. Like I said, just not announce it, just go there. You know, just go there under the radar and do everything that I can to, you know, hopefully win so, the show. Let me ask you this: If you're the best guy in men's physique, why switch to classic? Um, I truly love posing, and I truly love being able to grow. And I see myself evolving into that division, and um, I aspire to be. You know, I, I look at the guys like uh, like Lila Brada. You know, a lot of the legends of the sport that are just super smooth on stage and how they're posing and. And I just get chills, you know, whenever I watch their posing, and it's just—it's so sensational. And I want to—I want to be able to do that, you know. I want to learn how to, how to, how to be able to flow like these guys that I, I that I've looked at for so many years of my life, and that I and, and that I've been able to, you know, try to shape my my physique and my mindset and, and everything that I do, you know, towards their towards what they've done in their career. So I mean, I want—I just want to do that, you know. It's—it's it's, it's a goal of mine. I mean, it's, I got you. I got you. I, that, that's where you lost me for a second. I was just yeah. trying to follow. Okay, Sorry, yeah. so you won't be doing San Antonio next weekend. No, sir. No, sir. Okay, it was it was a thought. It was backstage right. talk. Yeah, no, no, no. You're good. You're good. I want to be sure that I didn't misspeak. Oh, no. That's all. I will that's be there all. though. I will be there. You I'll be, be at there. the show. I'll be hanging out with my coach, and I will be there and uh, uh, just showing support for the NPC IFBB and and all the athletes that are competing in the show. Okay, well, guys, they, they to all you past top six or seven men's physique guys. He is coming for the for the title this year, but uh, if, if he doesn't walk away with the title, you guys are lucky he's leaving the division. <laughs> lucky. So you guys are lucky, I guess, because he is the best. You heard it here. You heard it here first. There you have it. a lot it. of hate from him, but uh, that's the name of the game. It's, it's, it's competitive. I mean, I like I like how, you know, in the men's physique division, we all, we all kind of nag at each other. You know, it's competitive. It keeps us all working. It, it makes us all grow. I mean, I know there's a lot of tension in the division, but uh, – like I said, I think that makes everybody better. I think that's that's what makes this sport, you know, great. You know, I think that's that's what brings a lot a lot more uh, a lot more of us guys to the next level because we want to keep working hard to beat it, to beat each other that is keep nagging at each other. So I, I think I think there'll be a lot of conversation about this interview. There, there, there definitely will. There definitely Absolutely. will. Absolutely. Yep. Well, until next time, guys. Logan Franklin, Mandis Buckle. Hey, you you top six. I'd like to hear from you. Until next time, man, it's welcome, Maximum Muscle Report. We're out. I want to hear from you guys. <laughs>